Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition for Thursday, April 2nd. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather will stay delightful today, nice and dry. Most of the weekend rain-free, but next week the weather turns a bit unsettled with at least a chance of scattered showers and storms each day. Upper air look, again today a northwest flow aloft and a very dry air mass and a chilly morning. Seeing some 30s on the board. These were taken at 4 a.m., Cullman 35, Gadsden 38, Pell City 37. We'll expect a high today around 70 in most spots, still a touch below average. No issues here, but look up north. Winter storm warnings in effect for parts of Minnesota, the Dakotas, and Wyoming. Winter hanging tight up there. Here's the severe weather outlook today. Got a small marginal risk for parts of Kansas and Oklahoma. Tomorrow, a chance of severe storms over parts of South Texas. Day three, which is Saturday, maybe some thunder to the west, but no severe storms expected. Here's the rain for the next seven days. Heavier totals over Texas in Alabama. One inch or more for the north, under one inch for the south. And this is valid through Thursday morning of next week. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the OZ run, valid this afternoon at 4. Again, ridge axis to the west, a northwest flow aloft, and a beautiful day. Bright sunshine, low 70s. And look at the snow over North Dakota, South Dakota, some of the adjacent states. Wow. Tomorrow, a nice day, partly to mostly sunny. Highs mid to upper 70s. Showers well to the west. Maybe some strong storms over South Texas. Day three, Saturday. Again, there might be a shower somewhere over northwest Alabama, but I think most areas dry, mild, highs well up in the 70s, a mixture of clouds and sunshine. This is Sunday. We'll mention widely scattered showers, but again, widespread rain not expected. The high 77 to 80. Here's next week. This is Monday, and next week's going to be a little like summer. We're going to have scattered showers and storms around. That means it's going to be hard to give you specific start stop times for rain for any one given spot highs every day should be around 80 here's tuesday wednesday and a week from today thursday the 9th got a big trough in the southwest a zonal flow here and again scattered showers and storms highs upper 70s low 80s well we go out to the next day this is the night of Friday, April 10th. And if this is right, that trough lifts out. A surface low is south of St. Louis, and that could bring strong to severe storms if this is right. And, and we all know this is voodoo and this could change. Just something to keep an eye on. This is way out there at the end of next week. And then this is out 10 days, Saturday the 11th, troughing rotating to the north, and the drier air mass comes in as that wave moves on to the east. Here's the rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble. For the next 15 days, the mean... Between two and three inches. Still no sign of any cold air after this cold snap exits. You can see highs uh, most days in the upper 70s, lows in the 50s and 60s through April 12th. And this is the period April 9th through the 15th from the Storm Prediction Center. Still suggesting temperatures, temperatures here will be a bit above average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. AS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort.